can you identify this nerve right here? Now, if you want more questions like this, comment anatomy down below and we'll send you a link. So starting off first, what are we looking at? Well, we're looking at a dissection of the posterior pharynx. Starting off first, you can see this right here. This is going to be our spinal cord. It has been severed. These would be our occipital condyles. So you can see our vertebral column and our spinal cord has been removed and we've exposed those pharyngeal constrictor muscles. This is made up of three muscles. We have our superior, our middle, and our inferior. Another important muscle in this region is going to be that styloglossus muscle, which originates on the styloid process of the temporal bone and inserts into the back of the tongue region. So let's go and let's identify some of the nerves found within this area. This right here, this is going to be our sympathetic chain. And coming off that sympathetic chain, this is where we're going to have our superior sympathetic ganglia. Now, as we move a little bit more laterally, this is where we're going to have our vagus nerve right here. And coming off the vagus nerve, we're going to have our superior laryngeal nerve right here. Now, just lateral to that, that is where we're going to have our hypoglossal nerve right here. This would be our accessory nerve right here. This nerve right here, which is going to travel on top of that styloglossus muscle. And if that's any indication as to what this nerve is, that's going to be our glossopharyngeal nerve or cranial nerve nine.